A former deputy minister for Western Housing, Samuel Yao Eduse, has called for a complete overhaul of the leadership of the National Democratic Congress. He believes the NDC stands a better chance of winning the 2024 elections if the two main contenders for the chairmanship position, Samuel Ofusu Ampofu and Johnson Nasidun Ketia, are booted out. The Asian National Democratic Congress has set December 17 as the date to conduct its internal elections to elect executives from constituency, regional and national levels. Several individuals have declared their intentions to contest for various positions in the party. The latest among them is the Deputy Ashanti Regional Minister, Samuel Yao Eduse, who is optimistic about the NDC's victory in 2024 general elections. Addressing a press conference in Kumasi, Samuel Eduse explained that the party now needs a new face to lead it into the 2024 elections. He stated that the country is currently facing extreme hardship under the MPP government. Hence, the need for the NDC to win back power in 2024 to save Ghanaians. I can follow the party. That the chairman he worked with, the person he has known over the years, does not deserve to get another term. The chairman, on the other hand, that's the incumbent chairman, on the other hand, has known this general secretary for almost two decades. He has worked with him as general secretary, general secretary. And he is also telling us that this is my general secretary that I've worked with does not deserve to move up, to occupy the position I'm occupying now. Who are we to doubt these two experienced politicians? They are telling the members of National Democratic Congress a message that there should be a new face and that they have no confidence in each other. That's the communication to the party. That they have no confidence in each other to occupy such a position. He also reiterated the need for the party to elect executives who are fearless, committed, and loyal to spearhead the affairs of the party from branch through to regional and national levels.